now from South Seminole Academy in Castleberry, Florida. Direct from the third floor of building number three, this is South Seminole News. Good morning, Hurricanes. Happy Tuesday. I'm Bristol. And I'm Cameron. It's January 19, 2021. Welcome to the South Seminole News. At this time, please stand for the pledge. Let's check in with Elisa for the daily report. Hello, Elisa. Good morning, guys. Today's weather is clear with no rain. It's cool out with a high of 66 degrees. Keep warm and bundle up. A reminder, if you take any photos of yourself this school year, send them to us at SouthCivilNews at Yahoo.com so that we can put them on the news. Here's the riddle for today that we will answer after a commercial break. I'm tall when I'm young and I'm short when I'm old. What am I? Find out after the break. Now let's take you to the South Seville Lounge for lunch report. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Today's lunch special is a 100% all beef burger of, or black bean burger with french fries. All meals include fruit, vegetables, milk, or juice. And a reminder that you have two indoor options for the school year, the cafeteria and the leadership hall. And also, you must stay there once you are seated. Red Apple Dining wants to remind you that you can manage all your meals at, online at www.myschoolbucks.com. Once again, today's riddle is, I'm tall when I'm young, and I'm short when I'm old. What am I? Find out after the break. That's all for today's report. If you or your class would like to record anything here in the South Seminole Lounge, please contact the newsroom. We'll see you next time. Now back to you in the studio. Thanks. You'll find more news from the South Seminole Lounge every week on the Friday afternoon show. Be on the lookout for three shows every week. The Dean's Den on Fridays with Mr. Fernandez and Miss Pearson. Mindset Monday with Dr. Coleman every Monday morning. And Hurricane Smiles with this Miss... Our shaft on Tuesday starting next week. A message from the Beta Club. Any students that would like to wear a hat on Fridays may do so for the price of $1. With your $1, you will receive a wristband to wear your hat. Please visit any of the three classrooms down below on the screen to turn in your dollar. This will take place every Friday until the end of February. Thank you from the South Seminole Beta Club. The Latinos in Action Club is taking another step to getting involved with our community and help those in need. The students made beautiful handmade bracelets and will be selling them for $1. The money raised will be used to purchase blankets for the homeless in our community. To, pur to purchase a bracelet, please visit, visit room 231. Also, take a picture of your new bracelet and send them Send us the photo at SouthSeminoleNews at Yahoo.com. Attention teachers and students, the 2021 volleyball season will be starting this week. All home games will be on Wednesdays after school. The first home game in this is this Wednesday, January 20th, against Tuscaloosa. The boys will play at home and the girls will be away. The following week after that, the girls will be home as they play Lawton Childs. The volleyball season is no longer open to any spectators. Select people will attend with an invitation. For more information on this, please watch the January 8th episode of the Dean Sten on our YouTube page. They will explain the rules from the county office. For any questions about the volleyball season or team practices, please see Mr. Heiss in room 233. We will broadcast the volleyball seasons live on our YouTube page at youtube.com slash news beginning around 3.30 p.m. that day. Junior games will be followed by the varsity team. Like and subscribe our YouTube page so that you will get an alert when the live feed starts. Message from Mr. Motley in the PBS store. You can support the PTSA with a new mask. Come by the PBS store inside the cafeteria during lunch to check out these items. Children and teens 18 and under are eligible to receive breakfast and lunch meals at no charge as determined by the USDA. This includes student attending face-to-face -face and all remote learners. Visit the link below for all the information. That's tinyyearold.com slash scpsfreemeal. A message from the SSA yearbook staff. You can still pre-order your yearbook at www.jostines.com for the price of $40. Also, if you take any good photos, send them to us at SSA yearbook at yahoo.com. If the yearbook staff likes your photos, they may end up in the book. 
Take photos all school year and send them your best ones. Good luck, school photographers. We are going to take a quick commercial break. When we come back, we'll tell you more about our riddle t of the day and also the hero home. We'll be right back after this. Well, good afternoon, Mr. Miles. Welcome to a fantastic Frozen Friday. Today we are having Jeremiah's Italian Ice. They come out on Fridays and they have two different sizes. They have a $3 small cup and a $4 large cup. So make sure that you guys come on out, bring your money on Fridays, and enjoy this fantastic Florida weather and enjoy your frozen icing. You wanna go over and say hi to her? Yes, absolutely. If you guys have not had an opportunity to meet Miss Jackie, say hi, Jackie. Hi. Jackie is the general manager at the Castleberry Jeremiah's Ice. So you wanna make sure that when you come by, um, and to Jeremiah's Ice and Castleberry, you yeah, make sure you yeah. say hello to Miss Jackie, okay? okay? Awesome. It's going to be four dollars. Have it ready for you at the end. So How's business today? It's going great. We're super excited to be here. Mm. Thank you. Hi. Jackie has also informed me that we're going to be having a great promotion for all of our hero students who are on Connect. We're going to have something for them that can be sent out. If you receive a positive referral, you will be receiving an email on what the next steps are to, re to receive your free Jeremiah's Ice from Jackie at Castleberry. Welcome back. Today's riddle is, I'm tall when I'm young and I'm short when I'm old. What am I? The answer is a pencil. Look for more riddles all this month. Today we will continue spotlight different businesses and that they're helping the Seminole County Sheriff's Foundation. The foundation raises money to support police officers and their families here in Seminole County. Here's a look at the construction of the home and one of the businesses that donated their time and resources. Ooh, Jeff, Jeff, good job. Uh, okay, so we're here with Jeff Lane. Jeff, first of all, thank you so much for your involvement in every bit of this hero home as everything you'll notice is about taking it up another level, right? And here we have these beautiful details Jeff, nobody can talk about it better than you. Right. Uh, yeah, I'm Jeff Lane. I'm the owner of Alliance Pavers, and we've been in business for almost 20 years, and, you know, we're just happy to be a part of this. Central Florida is our home, so anytime we get to recognize a hero in law enforcement, we're excited to do that. Well, can we talk about some of the intricate things that you did? Because it's one thing to say, all right, so we've got some brick pavers here. It's another thing to say, you've aligned this place with walls, and there are uh, uh, attention to details that I would love to show off. Well, it started with a conversation with Ted and Eric, and we talked about the elevation of the yard and where the landscape needed to be and, and was it necessary for a landscape retaining wall. We figured out that it was. We needed one in the front and in the back to maintain yard space. So it started off with the retaining wall, which turned out beautiful with the landscape. And then we added, we thought, you know, brick pavers are a beautiful curb appeal. They're a great finishing touch. Why don't we do the driveway and the lead walk and front porch? And we were happy to do that. And it turned out great. We're proud of it. It turned out, I mean, this yeah. this is super fancy. I'm probably going to have you come to my house if you don't mind. <laughs> no problem. Uh, but thank you no again problem. for your Love involvement with the hero. Uh, yeah. Can you say something really quick to the hero who's going to be in this house and make this their home and make memories? Yeah, and you know, when we can recognize someone who provides security for our community, that's important to us. You know, it, it's really important that we recognize those individuals that, that are heroes you know, to all of our families and protect all of our families in Central Florida. So one of the thing I wanted to make a shout out to Old Castle Bell Guard. They are our paver manufacturer. They've been partners with us for many years. They provided all of this material. They donated all of the pavers oh, and all wow, the retaining wall wow. blocks. So that was big and I want to make sure we shout out to them. So. Sure, sure. The, uh, again, for anybody who's watching, it's the multiple layers of love, like uh, the stuff that's been donated. Uh, the words that come out of these individuals' mouths, I mean, it's real. Yeah. Uh, appreciate you, Jeff. Yes, sir. Yeah, this has been I'm amazing. Excited, excited yeah. to be a part of it. Hey, this is Thank this is just much. this is just the beginning. Be on the lookout for more Hero Home videos all this month, or visit the page at YouTube.com/HeroHome. That's all for today. Make sure to check us out on Instagram and YouTube at South Seminole News, and don't forget to subscribe. Also, please like the South Seminole Academy and PTSA Facebook pages for more info. And students, every day here at South Seminole Academy, we strive for, we strive for success, take responsibility, opt to lead, respect others, and make good choices. Thanks for watching. I'm Bristol. And I'm Cameron. Have a great Tuesday, and don't, don't forget, forget to storm! storm.